Alright, so 6 3. Again, we're doing volume. Where are your units going to be in? Square. Volume of pyramids and cones. Okay. Here's the difference. Yesterday, or Friday, you had the area of the base times the height. Area of the base times height gives you volume. Today, a pyramid and a cone is one third of the area of the base times the height. Here's the difference. You just divide by three. One times this volume gives you the volume, and then you divide by three, right? Okay, so this it's the same thing. Area of the base times the height divided by three. Exactly the same thing. There's not much difference about this. So this should help uh, kind of get you through some questions about last week. Yes. So let's look at two examples, all right? First example, everybody draw a parallelogram. Oh, wait a minute, before you start, before you start. Okay, this needs to be a rhombus. The back side is dotted. Okay. Everybody draw a parallelogram. That's about, all the sides have to be the same length. So it's a rhombus. Do that? Awesome. Uh, uh. Now, can I go on? Now, the center of this is about right here, right? Okay, go straight up from there and put a dot. Go down. No. center of this rhombus is here, and I just went straight up from it. Oh. That's okay. I'm not very strong. Okay, put a dot. Ready? Now, connect all the corners, and then wait before you start. The back corner has to be dotted. There. And then all the other ones can be solid up to that dot. The best you can. Now, your pyramid. Eight. Eight, which is eight. 
Everybody calculate that out. Length times width is the area of the base. The base is a square, right? right I thought you said a long bit. What? Well, a pyramid, if you look at it from the top, it will be a base. It will be a square. Yeah. Okay. Shut up. <laughs> okay. I'm just showing you how to draw it. Oh, okay. Because you're looking at it at, from a corner in, all right? Shelby is going to give us the answer. Four times four is? Times eight? Divided by three. It's a long one. Four, two, point six, 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 seven. Okay, so point, 42 point six repeating. No, there's a seven here. Yeah. But your calculator rounds the last number of it. That's wrong. So 42.7 cubic inches will fit into that pyramid. How many people is that? Wait, I'm sorry. I rounded to the nearest tenth. Oh, I think it's nice. I love math. I know. I know. That's math. Okay, can you do this or not? Yeah. yeah. You understand rounding. All right, that's a pyramid. It's one third of a prism, right? What the prism? You did Friday. I'm not answering that question. Example two: <laughs> cylinders. Everybody draw. No way before you draw. Watch what I do. I'm going to draw an ellipse, and the back side will be dotted. A flattened circle. <laughs> Everybody get 69? 